Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of The Sims 3 University Life, episode 19. Last episode, uh, Angelina uh, signed and rolled back up for the university to finish her physical education degree. And we're just picking back up with the... Uh, Starson family. Yuck. No surprise, because that candy bar is disgusting. I don't even know why they put that candy bar out. Let's see. We'll just leave that there for somebody. Like, we can't, we can't, seriously, we can't. Okay. We'll just sell it then. Just know it's like we're deeply, deeply covered, and it's so beautiful. But it's it's springtime, so it should be melting away soon. Great, we should get rid of this piece of crap. It's so bad; it's not even worth anything. You know a candy is nasty when you go to sell it and it's worth nothing. So we're just going to fast forward through this on speed three. Yeah, when she comes out, she's got to vomit. But, I've been looking at a lot of Sims 4 gameplay, and it looks very promising and exciting. I am anxious to actually play the game myself. I mean, I can get past the fact that they don't have toddlers or pools in the game, but at the same time, you know... I can look past that. It looks very, very fun. And I can't wait to try it. So I'm curious about you guys. Are you guys gonna, like, what, what's she doing? Mm, we really just, we gotta go home. I don't wanna, I really don't wanna get your kitchen. But yeah, I'm curious. Are you guys, like, Excited for The Sims 4? What do you think about it? Or do you guys want to like... Are you... Did you pre-order? Because I, I know I didn't. At first, I was going to be, be like pre-order. But when they announced that there was no pools and potlers, I was like... Well, I better wait. And that's what I did. I waited. And... I was initially I was just gonna say that I wasn't gonna buy it until they put back the t toddlers, at least the toddlers. Pools, not so much. I, I really don't too much. I mean, it's cool to have, but you know, I can live without it. Toddlers, you just cannot call it The Sims if you don't have every life stage. Everybody knows you go from baby to toddler to child. You don't go. Baby, child, teen, young adult, adult, elder. That makes absolutely no sense. I know a lot of people are like, 
Well, you know, they didn't have the young adult stage until they did The Sims 3, The Sims 2 University. And that, that added the young adult stage. And they didn't have, like, toddlers in The Sims 1, so, you know. Yeah, that's true. That's true. But still, you know, we've gotten so custom used to The Sims having toddlers in the game that it's like, practically, we can't go back to the old style or way. I mean, I, I, like I said, I can get past that and look forward and just play the game as it is and enjoy it. And it's looking like they added a lot of new things in there to make The Sims more unique. I won't say you should have, uh, I should have had the decenter on that. Um, yeah. Bed. Why, why do you want to do that? Anyways, the game just looks fun overall and exciting to play, and I definitely uh, did not want to see that. Did not want to see that. Anyways, I'm just excited to uh, get my hands on it and play. Let's see, how can we study? Yeah, so post in the comment section. Are you guys like excited to play The Sims 4? I know I am. And, uh, like I said, I'm definitely going to get my desktop fixed. And I'll be able to play it. I'm also thinking about doing the boot camp for my MacBook Air. I think the easy... Wow. This is interesting. Don't get close, Angelina. Yeah, that's all you should use is the microwave since you can't cook. Well... <laughs> That was interesting. This place is starting to be filled with supernatural creatures. Yeah, if we can get that up, we'll be doing great. Okay. Oh, wow. Dude, uh, poor Nikita.
Is she like in our friend zone? No, I think she's only like friends with. Yeah. Yeah. That's only Krista's friend. Wow. I got. I don't know. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I'm dead. Yeah. She wakes up. Um, let me see. What are her needs? I think she's fine. So we'll just walk away. Mm. Okay. We only have one class today, so I think we can do, like, I don't know, if there's a party, maybe we'll go to one.
Is that the door? I know like one thing, like when the Sim 4 does come out, it doesn't mean that I'm gonna like stop playing Sims 3. Cause it's like a lot of a lot of YouTubers are like they make this hashtag called the uh, the farewell Sims 3, and it's like going down memory lane about what. The Sims 3 did for your life, and how has it impacted and changed your life, and what was your favorite thing about The Sims 3? But just because The Sims 4 are coming out, I feel like you don't have to like abandon the uh, the previous version of the game, because people are still playing The Sims 2, and that came out like ages like ago. And I think it's going to be the same with the people on The Sims 3. Because the base game, it's it's kind of like the starting foundation for, um, yeah, the starting foundation for the rest of the game. And then, of course, you got your expansion packs, which improves the game. So it just, like, improves the game. Makes it better. The base game is just like the start of the storyline and you can just take it from there with the expansions. But I was like curious with the Sims 3 Collector's Edition. Do you like get any new hairs that are not available like in the standard Sims 3 game? Because, you know, I know like a lot of Collector's Edition games, they give you special... They give you like special items that can't be found that can't be found in the regular game. So I was just curious about that. <sighs> uh, let's go have her work out some. What's our favorite music? It is classical. I don't see how you can work with classical. I know, like, this also gives you, increases your, uh, kill. So we'll just fast forward through this. Oh, yeah, we got the squeak class. All right.
Okay, so I'm just gonna pause it right here. Not a lot happened in this video because uh, class studies. But anyways, leave a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. I love you guys very much, and I'll see you in my very.